guys so it's the day after my laparoscopic surgery and i thought i would show you what they eventually found um wrong with me for the past six to nine month period i've been in a lot of abdominal pain um, i got tested i had so many tests for all different sorts of things things like endometriosis things like um like infection of wombs things like that and i mentioned in one of my previous videos that a couple of months ago i did have a really chronic kidney infection after that stemmed all of this pain and this is what has come of it now <laughs> so anybody that doesn't know what laparoscopic surgery is well it's my diagnostic uh, laparoscopic surgery um is when they do an incision into your belly button they do usually one into your belly button and then two on your sort of lower abdominal sort of ovary area um and they have a look at your ab abdomen and your uh, reproductive organs things like that see how things go things like your bladder your ovaries your uterus things like that and womb and whatnot so what they did um i've never been well i've never had surgery before um so it was quite scary going for anesthetic for the first time and um, not really knowing what to expect how i was going to feel how i was going to come out of it things like that and um turns out i came out of it and i was all right i was quite teary when i came out of it um the nurse helped me get up to go for a wee and I threw up like twice which was really embarrassing so obviously didn't feel very well at all after it um which then they gave me some anti-sickness drugs and a lot of pain relief and whoop whoop also having two cold sores down here um the antibiotics that I'm on at the moment is really helping to clear that up which is quite cool look how greasy my hair is I just want to have a shower um uh, is quite good so what they found is this image that I'm going to show I'm just going to hide my if I can hide my hospital details I'll give it a go if not don't stalk me um so this is what they found this is a fatty um it's fatty tissue and muscle tissue that is meant to help with childbirth child bearing whatever and where you can see let me show you a picture again where you can see at the top at the very top of the picture it's very tight it's very close to the top it's very fused to the top and it shouldn't be and at the bottom you can see kind of like it almost looks like a bum cheek Um, it's only meant to be attached to like a little bit of that so yeah they've had to cut the top so it's now off and the little bit at the bottom so it's kind of more flexible flimsy things like that down at the bottom of that picture is then my right ovary and my uterus which you can't really see in that and the top one is my bladder so all that looks very clear the next picture that i've got is my other ovary and that one is a lot more tucked in than this one and they thought that perhaps this was pulling on this quite a lot also causing me problems with like period pains and things like that i'm recording off my phone because my camera is just non-existent so yeah, we've now cut the uh, fatty sort of meant to be the material which was causing me these pains. Um, I'll show you my tummy, I'll insert a picture if not, I'm very swollen and bloated so don't laugh. Um, but here is one little, um, can't really see, um, hole mark, stitch, cross, <laughs> X marks the spot and then they went inside my belly button as well. And we can't really see, I'm not doing this very well, it's quite difficult. And the pain where they got rid of the um, fatty bit was literally right underneath my tattoo. And usually they make another incision here, just like that one. But luckily they didn't. So the tattoo is all good. How very cosmetic of me. Um, so yeah, now it's just healing process time. Um, what I will say is when you have a laparoscopic procedure, they do fill you up with CO2 gas, which really afterwards makes your shoulders very sore. And all your like chest diaphragm under your rib cage very very painful and um, a lot of people sort of asked if i could do a video just sort of explaining um what's been going on things like that i've mentioned briefly that i haven't been very well in some of my videos um so i just thought i'd let you know that that is the crack and hopefully i will start to feel better be uploading more but my main focus at the moment is just getting better and um, getting on my feet again and getting my strength back so i'll probably do another video updating you like maybe next week how i'm feeling and until then i'll see you soon and i hope you're staying well and out of trouble